Hey guys and welcome back to another review. Well, as you can see we're doing the last of the J94s from DJ Models. Uh, this one is an extra special one to me because I work with it at the Dean Forest Railway. So this is my camera will focus. Hans Law Austerity 3806. Wilbur Reverend W. Audrey OBE. So let's get into the box and have a look. Okay, so what we got in here? We got the standard um, DJ Models business card just saying it's been tested, approved, and dispatched by David Jones. So just like a, uh, and that's just saying about any faults and like where to go and um, how to email them. And then you get a nice little um, certificate. Yeah, just saying this certificate accompanies a DJ Models double scale Hunts Austerity model of number 3806 Wilbert, a limited run of 200 support in the Dean of Forest Railway. As you can tell, this is number 1017 of 200. So let's get in the box. Okay. So here she is. Well, he is. So you guys can see. Okay. Wow. First impressions, just wow. Let's just tilt the camera a little bit. There we go. Gorgeous. Okay. Let's start from this side. We got the plain metal rods, just how it is in real life. Black under frame. What is nice. A change from all the other, um, the other two. Uh, J94s I have. Um, <clears throat> we've got a black soul bar and a uh, walking uh, area that normally you'd walk on to uh, clean the loco or like a little ledge. Um, separately fitted black um, handlebars, uh, handlebars, um, handrail, sorry. Uh, you have beautiful red lining around the locomotive, as you can see around the cabs. Uh, you've got Wilbert's nameplate, so it says Wilbert uh, Rev W Audrey OBE. Uh, you got some lovely pipe work along here. Uh, as you can see in the cab, you got some beautiful. Uh, cab detail in there you got some uh, planked floors what is lovely it just brings the whole cab feel to life you got the uh, works plate just on the side of the bunker there coming round to the back we have a red buffer beam the standard red buffer beam and a um oh i can't remember what it's called sprung buffers that's it um you got the NEM coupling, you've got some beautiful red uh, lining on the bunker, you've got the glazed windows uh, with the um, coal protecting bars and separately fitted lamp irons. Coming around this side, exactly the same, but you've just got a, um, a red uh, reverser bar, uh, lever, and some. Uh, black footsteps what's also on the other side coming around the front you have beautiful lining around the saddle uh, separately fitted darts on the smoke box uh, smoke box door sorry um, separately fitted lamp irons sprung buffers and a NEM coupling uh, on top you have the standard uh, black chimney where the water goes in, the, the water column bit. Uh, you got some separately fitted uh, handrails just up here. Uh, you got the main dome and you got the uh, lovely brass coloured um, valve gear and whistles. 
and the standard black roof. This is a, a gorgeous model, as I said before, I worked with this at the Dean Forest Railway. So it's a beautiful locomotive to have, um, as I work with it. It's currently up in bits due to problems, uh, boiler problems. So hopefully it'll be back in service by next year. Okay, so let's uh, go and test it on the test track. So bring you guys over here. As you can tell, I've got the um, other J94s in the siding there. So I'm just going to bring her on. Uh, plug this back in because I unplugged it earlier. So here we go. Here she comes into view. There she is. So we're going to bring her back forwards. Oh, she jolted a bit. The tracks are a bit dirty here. So as you can see, she runs beautifully. So smooth. Bring it back forward. Okay, well, but let's go pick up some trucks. So if I just move the camera that way a bit, so you guys can see what's going on. She's going to pick up some uh, wagons. Up to the points, switch the points, over the points. Not too sure where I've put my uh, coupler and uncoupling stick. That's not coupled up. Just give me a little helping hand because the couplings do like to play up. Uh, where's my undercoupling stick? I don't know. Okay, so let's take her away. Should be around here somewhere. Got stuck on a bit of dirty track. Switch the points, bring her back. to this side in, slow her down, stop there, take it away a little bit, as you can see in the uh, wagons I do have a Lydney Coal and Co so it kind of fits in with the uh, Wilbert's location, so it just adds to the uh, extra value of the locomotive. Put that back in its side in. Oh, got stuck a little bit on that point there, on the nice dirty one. And being able to clean. So let's get this off here. And take it away. All the way back. And there you have it, the review on the Wilbert Class J94 locomotive, um, I hope you've enjoyed this video, and that is the last of the J94 reviews for now, um, hope you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe, uh, if you've got any comments about the model, please uh, don't be afraid to leave a comment on this video. Um, hope you enjoyed the video and I uh, hope to see you soon. Bye bye.